people really using mathematics in biology? Are they really, can they, can they use calculus? The calculus is the change of something. Can they use probability? The probability is the chance of something occurring. Well, of course, modern day biologists use something called hypothesis testing. You see, biology isn't like mathematics or physics. You can't simply prove something is true in biology. Every human is different. Something that works for me will work differently for you. So what they do is they do something called hypothesis test. And they have two hypotheses. There is no significant difference in one experiment, and there is a significant difference in the experiment. So what type of experiments do they do? Well, let's say that scientists have found a cure for COVID-19, and I hope that happens soon. Now, their job is to test how effective this vaccine is on a group of people. So they run an experiment, and they would test the group before the cure is given, and test the group after the cure is given to see if it was effective. And the statistical analysis, the probability analysis, would then determine with the probability how likely this cure works for a general population. And the nice thing about mathematics and statistics is that you can have a small group, let's say 25 people. And if the cure works for the 25 people for a significant amount, you can extrapolate that data to apply that to the population. The whole population you can use that to. And that's what people do. That's what scientists are doing. But of course, there's so many different cases they have to apply it to. It may only work for males. It may only work for females. It may only work for Indians. It may only work for Americans. They have to look at all these different parameters when they're doing the testing. But they obviously can't test it on billions of people, but they can test it on a small group and then hypothesize with the probability how this actually would work.